This company sent me their two-in-one jump starter with air compressor. Let me show you everything that you get with this and I'll show you how we used it. This is everything that comes with this little kit here. So you do get the actual, um, the jump starter and the air compressor here. It's pretty compact, I like that. Uh, so with this, you also get a user manual here. You get a couple different valves that actually go into this. So this is the air tube that connects to this. So if you need a, a different valve, you can just screw this in here. And then also it comes with a needle for like inflating uh, basketball or football, anything like that. All you have to do is screw it in and you have that capability as well. It comes with the jump starter clamps that connect to your battery and this will connect into this. I'll show you that in just a minute. Comes with a charging cable, which is a USB-C to USB-A charging cable. And the way that you charge this right here on the actual inflator and everything itself, it has a USB-C port. Just plug that in and then plug the other in into a wall adapter. And lastly, it comes with a bag. So you get this little bag with the drawstring at the top that you can pack everything in and store it. So that's pretty nice. To start off, when I opened this, I did make sure that it was charged up fully before I ever tried using this. Keep in mind the instructions say to not use this while you are charging it. To inflate a tire, all you have to do is take the air tube and this little port on here that is like outlined in red. All you have to do is insert this in and give it like a quarter turn. So this twists and kind of snaps in there. Once you get that on, all you have to do is screw the actual air tube onto your valve stem of your vehicle. To power this on, press and hold the power button in the middle and it will power up just like that. It does have a readout here on the screen that is nice. It actually shows you how much battery you have left and you actually see that that just went down because we did air up like three tires with this so it took about half battery. Um, but you'll see it has the PSI it has the uh, number that we have it set to. If there are some different units of measure, if you tap the little button right here, you can see it goes with like bar, and then KPA. Um, there you go. So you can tap that. We leave it on PSI, of course. And now it has some presets. Um, like if you can tap through this and go through, it shows you for like a, a motorcycle, bicycle, basketball. Kind of has some presets but we actually just set it on 44. And if you need to raise or lower this, it's pretty easy. All you have to do is hit the minus button or hit the plus button to get it where you need it. Now, when you connect this to your vehicle, it will show whatever the tire pressure is on the top. So that way you know how much is actually in there currently. Now, when you get ready to actually start inflating your tire, all you have to do is press the start button. It will automatically kick off when it has reached the desired pressure or you can stop it by hitting the start button again. One thing to note that all it takes is like a bump of this and then that can actually come out of the actual air pump here and then you start losing pressure. So make sure that that stays and that you don't touch that while you're airing up the tire. You will see a little LED light here on the top of the air compressor. and You can actually turn that on by pressing and holding the little look, looks like a light bulb button here so hold it down and then you will get the LED light to come on and then you just hold the button down again to get it to go off getting it to go off is a little bit trickier than getting it to come on and lastly the other great feature about this is is that if your car battery is dead all you have to do is plug up these cables into the actual charger here that has a port that you snap it in and then you connect these to your battery so you can jump start your car. And of course, when you're finished with everything, just pack it up and carry it with you.